Okay, time for my lunchtime ritual, keeping up with the daily news. First, let's check the Huffington Post. Hey, is that an ad for Future Bank? My friend Paddy works in FS. I remember him saying he's looking for a new job. I wonder if this could be right for him. Oh great, I can share the video with him directly on Facebook. Oh hey, Sarah sent me a link on Facebook. For Future Bank. Oh. Are you intuitive, customer driven and always looking ahead? If so, your future has arrived. Future Bank, always on the cutting edge of technology and focused on delivering unparalleled experiences to our value clients, is seeking customer-centric client service representative to be part of our growing team. In this role, you will process transactions accurately and efficiently in a fast-paced environment while simultaneously introducing products and services that meet the customer's needs and encouraging customers to expand their relationship with Future Bank. You must create a connection and develop reports with customers to provide outstanding personalized service. To be considered, you must have a minimum of six months customer service experience in financial services, retail sales, or a goal-orientated environment. You must have strong communication skills and active listening skills. Does this sound like the opportunity for you? Your future career has officially arrived. Join the wave of a new frontier in banking. Apply right now at the provided link. Okay, that video sold me. I'm interested. Uh, it's so quick and easy to apply right now. I can do this before my lunch is over. Ready to become part of a new frontier in banking services? Your future has arrived. We're Future Bank. Future Bank knows the importance of investments, and that includes the investments we make in our people. We offer a dynamic, innovative culture with top-notch benefits. Thank you for submitting your application to Future Bank. We are excited that you are interested in joining our team of professionals. Since the application process can be a bit of a mystery at times, we want to let you know what to expect during the rest of the application process at Future Bank. As the next step, we would like to invite you to complete a short, mobile-optimized online assessment called a Situational Judgment Test to help us decide whether you're the right fit for us. Once complete, you will hear back from us with feedback within 48 hours. If you have been successful, you will be invited to arrange a time for a video job interview. If you are chosen to continue the application processes following your video interview, you will again be invited to arrange a face-to-face -face interview with the hiring manager. At this time, a final decision will be made. If at any time during this process we determine that this position is not the right fit for you, we will notify you immediately. We commit to doing our best throughout the application process so that you feel informed. If you have a question at any point, our recruitment advisors will be available to help you on the phone or via our online chat function. If you feel that any part of the recruitment experience could be improved, please feel free to let us know, as we strive for continuous improvement and we appreciate your feedback. Thank you for your interest in Future Bank. Great. Now I know what to expect and I can actually do it later by email. Hi, I'm Patrick and I'd like to welcome you to your online assessment tool. The next step in the hiring process is for you to complete our online assessment. We take time in selecting our employees because it's important for you to be happy in your role and to ensure that we are a good fit for each other. To help us, we'd like you to complete the short online assessment to find out about you and how you'd approach various job realistic situations. Once you've completed the assessment, you'll receive an email confirmation with feedback on next steps in the recruitment process. In order to get the best possible results, we recommend that you complete the test in a quiet environment, free from any distractions, and ensure that you have a good internet connection. All you need to do now is click on the tab and start the assessment. Good luck! A customer you helped a few days ago has called into your workplace and asked to see you. They are unhappy with the service that they have received from the business and are demanding compensation. As you can imagine, they are extremely frustrated and would like to know what can be done. You know that if you need to, you have the capability to offer them compensation if necessary.
Now, what do we have next? Hi, let's spend a minute looking around the site so that you know what to expect when you start the simulations. The most important thing are the instructions. These appear in the lower left corner of the screen. You can hide them and bring them back up whenever you need help. Hi, I was looking at my credit card statement and noticed a charge that I didn't recognize. Hi there, my name is Patrick Wilson. I'll be helping you today. So first of all, could I get your name, please? Um, my name is Patrick Barnes. That's P-A-T-R-I-C-K, last name Barnes, B-A-R-N-E-S and uh, my phone number is 885-552-748. Okay, thanks very much, Patrick. I have your account details up now. So you said at the beginning of the call that you had an issue potentially with needing to dispute a payment on your account. Yeah, so the transaction I was calling about, it was for $279.19 on uh, let's see, April 12th, 2015, uh, a company called Diva Noodle. I, I looked them up and it's uh, a music concert site. Um, I definitely never bought anything from them. Okay, Patrick, yes, I can see the transaction made on the 12th of April for $279.19 from Diva Noodle. I can see that. So. I'm happy to dispute it for you, but the first thing uh, I need to ask, obviously, just in case, you know, uh, is there anybody else who potentially would naturally have access to your account or your card and could have made this uh, payment without your knowing? I'm the only person who should have access to this card. There's nobody else that would have, you know, had access to it. So I'm pretty sure somebody's gotten my information. So I want to you know, dispute this charge and then also get my account um, closed and get a new card out or something. Okay, that's fine. Yes, no problem, Patrick. I can cancel uh, this card and get a replacement card sent out for you, no problem. Um, that should take anywhere from five to seven working days, naturally. And then I will also dispute this charge for you and then we can put it through our system and that should be no problem at all. We can uh, just wipe it off and hopefully get a refund for you. So. That should be hopefully everything. Cool. So it sounds like you've gotten this taken care of. Um, thanks for your help. Have a good day. Thanks very much, Patrick. Have a good day. And just call back again if there is any other issues. Happy to help. Bye. Welcome back. I hope you found the assessment experience interesting and thank you for taking time to complete the assessment. We will be in touch shortly with further details on the next steps, but regardless of where we go from here, I wanted to express my very best wishes to you. Thank you. This was a refreshing application experience. I feel like my time was valued, they got to the point and were testing me in a way that gave me the opportunity to really stand out.